Oh, shit. Well, hello everybody, and this is a rough match. A very rough match. Lizards are really tough for orcs to deal with. Really, really bad matchup. Um, I might be getting a wizard here. But... I don't know. I, I, it's weird because they, they have the TV without the journeyman added. So just going to have to wait and see what his TV is. See what it, see what the team is. Alright, oh, snail backwards. It, hopefully this isn't the same guy. It's really slow. Um, okay, 170, so do get a wizard. Alright, that, that's good. But obviously it really sucks to be 170 TV down against lizard men. What an absolute nightmare. Got a couple of blocks. And is this piling on? Nice break tackle, okay. Well, at least I know what the logo is. And diving tackle, this one. And he's got a third reroll. Wow. Brutal. Brutal. 100, 170 TV down. And what again to be missing the black hole, okay? Wow. Horrible. And unfortunately, the fucking players. I guess could get a Merc Black Orc instead of a Wizard, but. Can't really. Could get a Merc Troll. Instead of the Wizard. But not really. A Wizard's just better, isn't it? Kill all the skinks. Ripper is just too much. Yeah. Oh, it's the stupid nerd guy, is it? Is that who it is? Right. He actually wasn't. He actually wasn't a bad player. The um, the stupid nerd guy. He just lost it. He lost it when he made a mistake. <laughs> Excuses in early pro tips. No, it, it's not an excuse. Lizard men are a horrible matchup for orcs. Horrible. Every time I use orcs, um, every time I use lizard men against orcs, it just feels like there's nothing I can do to possibly lose the game. And this is this is going to be rough. I'm definitely not just getting my excuses in early. And it's going to be a very tough game. So I'm going to put everyone wide to hopefully isolate Saurus. What we want is basically... His um, his seven good players, which is the Saurus and the Croxigar. Don't want to put the guy. He's probably going to put the Crocs in the middle, so don't want to have the alone in the middle. I just want to have him alone in the middle. People generally have their um, their big guy in the middle, so I tend to not put the journeyman in the middle. I tend to put the journeyman in the middle to get hit by the big guy. Sorry, I can't even speak. So yeah, the idea is to get these three shitters, these four shitters, and these three guys manned up on Saurus, and then the black the blitzers terrorize the skinks is the is the plan. And obviously his plan is to get a Saurus basing especially this guy. And the, he want, he wants the Saurus basing the blitzers. So they just get a 2D pound them all the time. And then a black orc is obviously way slower than a skink and hasn't got a block to get him down anyway. So, um, yeah, this is going to be rough. 170 TV down. <laughs> yeah, Saurus Orientis. Um, yeah, Liz is tougher. And I'm 170 feet TV down, you know? Like, if I had the fourth black orc even. You know, just anything more. I mean, for 170 TV, I could have a black orc. One of these could be a black orc, and then have seven skills, which could be like, you know, three block and three guard, and, and a piling on or a tackle or something. So it's a pretty massive disadvantage. Oh, this is good though. So he did put his big guy there. One, two, three, four, five, six. But then I would like to use the mighty blow, but I guess I don't get to. Right, so I do get to put um I do get to put my players in contact with his, I guess.
Obviously, it gives him more blit blocks, but at least, um, at least they're kind of tied up. Injury. Good. Blitz is pretty fair, isn't it? There you go. <laughs> One out of four gone, yeah. Not bad. <laughs> mm. Shit, it was his one guy with block. That's pretty annoying, isn't it? When lizard men one in nine, and it's a guy who, who has block. Fuck. Blitz is fair when you get it. Yeah, exactly. Look, Blitz is... Blitz is pretty fucking ridiculous, isn't he? He's starting the match with ten players. It's just stupid, isn't it? If he fails this pickup... It's going to be happy days, isn't it? Ah. Oh. Ooh. No, he's, he's pretty decent, to be honest, Jellio. He played well until he um, lost his mind last time. Obviously he's going to knock down the whole line here. But armor 9, hopefully, is going to hold up. And then, going to have, you know, Saurus manned up by, uh, by my shitters, basically. Eight armor breaks, eight injuries now for the Orcs in three games. <laughs> so he's done well. He's followed up with the right ones to isolate people. Um, holy fucking shit. I guess I should have stood all these up. That's a pro tip, isn't it? Should I, I mean, these guys weren't ever going to dodge away or anything. Maybe this guy could have dodged away, actually, if I'd moved him last. Yeah, I could have blitzed the ball carrier, couldn't have had powered him. Maybe. Yeah, pro tips is it continues to be a curse. Yeah, I could have blitzed the ball carrier there with a mighty blow, maybe. Yeah, of course. I mean, of course he's going to do this move. Makes sense, doesn't it? A guy with block and mighty blow gets him manned up. 
manned up on a saurus, that's exactly what he wants. Okay, he's not leaving him manned up on a saurus. Yeah, exactly, Arrested Development. It's really, it is really hard if you lose. You go down, ooh, nice. If you go down players as orcs, it's pretty tough. But of course, you shouldn't. You shouldn't go down men as orcs, so. One, two. One, two, three, four, five, six, J5, J. I can't hit him. Shit. No, I'm gonna block him there. Nice, wasn't it? Gonna try and blitz the ball. Oh, I don't know what I was doing. I mean, I've I've, I've gone on tilt massively here, but just because I'm. Oh my god! I'm still thinking about that game against the blasted dwarves. Yeah, he had to apple that, didn't he? If he's serious about winning. I guess everyone else stays where they are, and that's um. That's a good turn. <laughs> yeah. So obviously, would have liked to have used the wizard to stop him scoring and turn him over and make it a defensive touchdown, but um, okay. So he's he's down players, which is good. And he's used his apple, which is good. And now it's a six-turn drive to score with the possibility of using a wizard on offense. So it's gone pretty, pretty great right now. Yeah, that blitz, the blitz helped though, didn't it? I mean, it was better than him just not scoring. I should have maybe wizarded when he had the when he had those three there. Maybe I should have just fireballed. Maybe I should have fireballed last, last turn. Um, not last turn, but you know the set. Hit after his turn one, I should have probably just fireballed the three skinks, and then you know maybe maybe turned him over and gone in the half one nil up. Maybe if he'd lost, maybe if he'd already lost the Saurus, maybe he would have done. Like if he if he was down to eight players on the pitch. I mean, I could have still bought it at the end of the turn, couldn't I? I never, never got down there. Oh, fireball there, five players. Lost the wizard and all hope. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. One, two, three, four, five, six. GFI to hit the mighty blow is probably worth it. And. I guess feed him, feed him lineman here, feed him black orcs there. No. Gonna go for the knockdowns, I think. So he blocks him. Doesn't follow. Fuck's sake. Bit shit if he gets a blitz here. Oh, perfect defense. Perfect defense is absolutely crushing right now. Lucky nerd. Okay, putting coaching's okay.
Okay, that's a bit shit. Right, 2D here then. Got him. Right, and then what can he do? He can go there and just stand there. That's alright, isn't it? It's actually okay. He can do a GFI to base, and he does a GFI to blitz. Do I care about the pickup? I guess he can blitz and run forward and put a base on it. You skink. <laughs> and obviously, I won't reroll it if it fails, but if it works, I'm basing a skink, which is okay, isn't it? Right. Not bad. Not a bad turn. He's raging a little bit. Oh my god, it's so fucking lucky, bitch. Pfft. So this is where Orc Lyman earn their money. If you, if you get the, your Lyman on their Saurus, it's happy days, isn't it? Because you can get punched quite a lot and won't get injured. Yeah, cage the team. <laughs> yeah. Hey. Oh my god, injured. <laughs> God, I love it. Get to play ping pong with this fucking shithead skink as well. Right, so stand him up first. And him. And him. Oh, get him on the first one. <laughs> oh my god, KO'd. <laughs> KO'd. Brilliant. So he can stand up now because he ain't gonna blitz. Boo. Could GFI to make a block with him? I guess I've got three rerolls, so I might as well reroll this. Alright, good. Could 1D him? Could be a little bit dodgy actually, what can he do? He can knock these two off with him, chain him out. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go over here. Cause gotta get forward a little bit, haven't I? I'm not gonna make that 1D cause it could be a bit bad if it was both down. Kill is actually bad, yeah. That's pretty good though, isn't it? He's down. One, two, three, four, five players. <laughs> so yeah, it's it's looking pretty good. I mean he could mark the ball with a crocs or or a source or something. But he's literally spiral, yeah. Um yeah, so after, after all the hype of how bad this game was going to be, it's obviously looking pretty good right now, seeing as the uh, Mighty Blow guy has got three cars this game, I think. Pretty good. And he'll want to score, won't he, to go up to six. And 
Then maybe he gets another cars and a touchdown. Or I guess he gets the touchdown if all things being equal, he'll score and he'll score. <laughs> He's got three team fantastic. Penetrated his mega bunker. My god, the spiral mega bunker was amazing, wasn't it? Absolutely amazing. It has been superseded by the pussy cage now though. Oh shit. And stun's okay though. Finally an armor break that wasn't a death. Yeah, so he could blitz here. Yeah, he's, nah, he can't dodge as well, can he? That's the thing, I'm outnumbering by so many people, even if he does get on the ball somehow, can just blitz him off. Yeah, I saw that nose dive. <laughs> I didn't really understand it. Oh, because you had your, you had your agility 3. Oh no, R Rattan had the agility 3 black hole. Ratted you out. I don't, I don't know, I think. Ratting people out who cheat in a video game is a bit different to uh, fellow gangsters ratting each other out, isn't it? What's he going to do here then? Is he going to one dice or is he just going to two dice blitz with the crocs and then two dice with him as well? But I mean, I should be able to get two Ds on him. So, he can block him. He has to block him though, doesn't he? Oh, fuck's sake. Well, bad times. He gets, the, he gets the ball off us now. And do you know what? I should have moved him first. I should have moved him first. And I should have thought about blitzing him. Or at least marking him. Standing up him. So there you go, when you do your first action, a 1 in 81 chance of failure. No, it's too likely, isn't it? It's too likely to make a 1 in 81 failure. It's too likely, and that was just fucking bad play. It was bad play by him not taking a push, though, I think, because now he needs to get a... He needs to activate his crocs now. I guess he can just block him and stuff, but he needs to activate his crocs, but that was terrible play. He can just blitz the ball down now. Yep, safe moves first. That that was really, I mean, you don't expect a 1 in 81 to fail, but there was no real, like, I had to do it eventually. But yeah, this one I should have stood up. That was really bad, not standing that up. That was really bad, and he wasn't stunned. That was just really, really, really bad. Incredibly bad. Hey! Good, fuck you. Alright, good. Okay, so it worked out okay. But it was bad by him. See, if he'd just taken the push, he could have um, run around there. Oh, no, he couldn't have done. Okay, I guess it wasn't bad of him. Right. <laughs> right, he's now got to go last because he's got a GFI, hasn't he? Now get the mighty blow blitz in. That was pretty funny, wasn't it? Looker. Looker moves there. Do you find GFI? And then that, that seems like something I want to do. Get a pow here. No. <laughs> right, so I think push him into there and just get him to this move here. And then make two GFIs there. Right. Wow. <laughs> Fucking stupid looker. That's what he said. I mean, I have been lucky this game. Obviously, I got blitz. I failed in the ordering. Um, 
relying on a one in eighty one to not fail. And it is easy to get in the habit of just, you know, making blocks that you'll re roll first. Because you only punish one in eighty one. Spend three minutes to think about it. Yeah, I should do pro tip safe things first. No, cause just because it's so easy, like to not do it, isn't it? That's the thing. You, when you know you're going to re-roll the block, um, it's not such a big deal. Yeah, all of his kings are out already. It's funny, isn't it? Stop rolling skulls. Don't roll ones. Should have been the Wood Elves one. The Wood Elves one should have been don't pro tip roll. Don't roll ones. And then the Orcs one would be pro tip. Don't take seven cards from seven armor breaks. Him, can't he? I guess I should mark him there. Here. And then I want to blitz him and then mark afterwards. So I'll do this one first. Just don't want him. We're gonna obviously hit a guy without blocks. There's more chance for knockdown, like that. Oh my god! <laughs> Into injury. <laughs> Holy shit! And then put him there so it blocks off the chance of the Saurus there. Take the ball down because he ain't got block. Wow! <laughs> Pretty good game, isn't it? Taking Mighty Blow on that guy was uh, it's paid off with four cars. Four cars in his next match. <laughs> no Mighty Blow needed, but still. This is the lucky nerd guy, yeah, uh, Aguillon. Yeah, this is lucky nerd. This, and, and I guess that's why, yeah, there was no Mighty Blow in needed, but that's why it looks like uh, people, you know, say that Mighty... War dancers have hidden mighty blow because war dancers are making every single blitz that you make as wood elves. So they're obviously going to injure more people, aren't they? <laughs> two out of two. Yeah, this is definitely the better game against snails. 100%. Oh shit, the window's open. There should be loads of background. Fuck. Right, I'll, I'll just switch off this for a second. I'll be right back. Fuck's sake. Forgot about that left the window open. Never mind. Hopefully it isn't it isn't too bad the sound. Lucky nerd guy is quite unlucky, yeah. <laughs> show, show window I can. Um yeah, you can't blame him for being salty, can you? I mean he's taken he's taken he's only had his skinks blocked about five times, five or six times. He's taken three cars. You know, taking two Saurus cars. Um, he has been absolutely, he's been horribly unlucky. And, and you know, I like, I, I've, I don't know, I just, it's okay, isn't it? You know, I like, maybe I would have beaten him if I hadn't been really lucky, but yeah, I have been really lucky. But, you know, what can you say? I'm not going to apologize for winning. <laughs> uh, this is your team every match. <laughs> They're both the same guy. No, I don't think so. I just think it's um Yeah, he did make no effort to protect the skinks on D, yeah, that's true. Yeah, they have behaved very differently, yeah. This guy's just swearing all the time. But they are both one one was like tiny snail and one snail backwards, isn't it? Yeah, I may have beaten him anyway, yeah. I mean I think I would have done, but as it was, I just hammered him. And probably nobody could have won against this kind of dice, maybe. Wow, he made this dodge. Fails the GFI though. Oh, please fail the loner. <laughs> I 
<sighs> Great stuff. Can I three dice this guy? Um, three, four, five, six, seven. No. <laughs> Go to hell, noob. <laughs> oh no, I don't get the touchdown. Shit. Shit. Shit, don't get the touchdown. I should have moved quicker. <laughs> should have moved quicker. <laughs> it was funny though. One into a two. Beautiful. Obviously don't want this crappy lineman. Oh, this crappy lineman. And, oh, okay, so he got the MVP, so that was alright. So skilled up a blitzer anyway. <laughs> you have to that tilt in chat to down here. Yeah, I should have done the touchdown quicker. I should have done the touchdown quicker. And that's the size missed next game, but that's all. Alright, that's okay. Um, right, Aurelensis can get his guard. Well, that was a much better game than the dwarf. Oh. Right, and I guess... So now I've got the full four Black Orcs for the next match. He's only one Kaz away from piling on. He's a touchdown away from guard. He's two touchdowns away from guard. Might as well buy the... Um, buy the extra player later. Two loaned linemen wouldn't be that bad. Because this way I've got the 100k to buy a wizard if I have to. So... I think having a loan alignment is okay. And then when I don't have missed next game then buy the then buy the guy. <sighs> Get a troll. No, I, not not with TV matching. I would I would have a troll in a league, but not not when I'm going to get it's just going to make me get matched to yeah plus there's not enough for a troll not when it's just going to get me matched against chaos but um that was that was game number three wasn't it so um pretty much better than the last game if you enjoyed it don't forget don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic <laughs>